guys, so for today's video, we are going to play a game. This game is called Chinese Garter. I got this feeling. Fun fact, Chinese Garter is called Chinese. Jump rope in other countries, it originated from China in the 7th century. They play it before during the celebration of Chinese New Year. It was passed from generation to generation and has become popular even in other countries. Chinese Garter is a game that requiring flexibility, balance and coordination. It is a popular game for Filipino children, most specifically among girls during their elementary years. Mechanics of game, players are divided into two or more teams, with a minimum number of two members per team during the game. Two members of the first team shall serve as game posts, and they stand opposite each other and hold each end of the garter. The objective of the game is to be able to successfully jump over the garter as it is gradually held higher by the game posts. Just like in the game 1020, each team also has its own team leader, more commonly known as the mother. Once a team member either touches the garter or fails to jump at a certain level, the mother can still save her team by taking her team member's turn. Failure to do so will lead to the team's elimination by making them the new game posts and will bring the game back to the first level. Let the game begin. Team A Marlito and Shella. For the final level, this level of Chinese garter is required tremendous amount of energy and players should have a skills in jumping to be able to pass this level. The game usually ends after the highest jump, however, some kids would continue playing the game backwards instead of raising the garter higher. The post shall hold the garter back to its lower position. Bones. It goes electric, baby, when I turn it on 
All through my city, all through my home We're flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone I got that sunshine in my pocket Got that good soul in my feet I feel that hot blood in my body When it drops, ooh I can't take my eyes off of it Moving so While playing Chinese garter, I suddenly remember my elementary days, which I used to play this together with my friends. This game is so nostalgic. Shella, Chinese garter is a game that is so hard to play. It requires a lot of energy and skills in jumping. James, even though I'm not used to play this game, I can say that this game is one of the most hardest game I play in my life. Also, it improves your jumping skills and flexibility. Johnard, I really enjoy playing this game. This is my first time to play this game. Dot when I'm in my elementary days, I've seen so many children playing this game. I can say that this is one of the most popular game in the Philippines. Johnry, this game has a lot of benefits to us. First, it improves your flexibility and your balance. It also increases your sense of belonging to your friend and create happiness and reduce your stress. 